Billy, is, is this our house? Yes, it is. Billy, this is so beautiful. <laughs> I'm very like it. What? Oh, no, baby, you outdid yourself completely. The bag. Wait, this, this is ours? Yes, it's ours. Oh, baby, I love you so much. Right. I'm glad you like it. I, wait till you see the what inside. What are you talking about? Babe, wait, wait, wait. Lana needs to see this. Oh, wow, okay. You already know? <laughs> this is our house! <laughs> Baby, baby, thank you so much. You're the best, and I love you. I love you too. Thank you, baby. Okay, let's go see inside. Of course. Wow, this looks very expensive. <laughs> yes, it is. Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God, this is so beautiful, baby. Right? Oh, baby, this is so posh. Look at this. I really like it. I'm glad what? You like it. Babe. Oh no, baby, you outdid yourself completely. Yeah. You know <laughs> Lana needs to see this. She needs to see the interior. Baby, what did the interior? Um, I, I got someone to do it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Lana, can you see the interior? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll send you pictures soon. Ah, oh, baby, you have totally outdid yourself. I love it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I love you, baby. Mm. No, I love it. All right, come on. Let me show you upstairs. Okay. Let me Let's show you around. Go. Babe, this is. You're not always wanted to get something like this. That's it's beautiful. It's nice. <laughs> so beautiful. Yep. Ooh, my husband is The food was amazing. I feel like I've added 10 pounds for this trip. <laughs> now you want to get married? Yeah, just tell your guy to hasten some things up. Um, let me call you back later, okay? Yeah. Are you talking to your friends about me again? Mm -hmm. mm. You know I can't help but brag with you. <laughs> Wait, are you heading to work, babe? Yes, food I is am. not even ready. Babe, I'm in a hurry. Terry is waiting for me. Plus, I told you that I'm not a breakfast person. I don't know why you bother with these things. Well? I just wanted to cook something nice for my honey pie. <laughs> <laughs> You're so sweet. I know, baby. <clears throat> but I have to go, babe. But babe, wait. Um, can't Terry take care of the office? I need to spend some more time with you. <laughs> oh, baby. Just the two of us. If we keep doing this, we're going to go broke. Then why do you have me? I'm your sugar mama. <laughs> <laughs> OK, that sounds really nice, but I have to go, OK? There's this client that we need to see this morning. and. Terry has really been trying. The workload has been on his shoulders since the wedding. Mm. Okay, I have to go. I'll see you soon, okay? Mm, baby, I don't okay. want you to go. Baby, I just, I need to go and make money, okay? Mm. Okay, I'll see you how, soon. How soon? Once I'm done with work. Promise? Yes, promise. Promise I'll call you every second. Yep, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> well, all right, bye. Don't go. Take care of yourself, okay? I'll see you soon. Yes, my love. He, he just left for work. This guy. My guy, my guy. Yes, yes, I, oh, babe, excuse me, let me quickly pick the call. Um, yes, I can hear you. Yes? No, but you know what you did was not nice. My guy, why are you doing this now, eh? What is the meaning of this? Yes, where's my money? No, no, no. I, I don't like this thing you're doing. This is the reason why I do not like to do business with friends. You were supposed to pay me two weeks ago. Up till now, I haven't seen my money. 
And how is that my problem? Your secretary made a mistake and sent the money to the wrong account. How is it my problem? You need to go to the bank and fix it. Send me my money now. Is it until I escalate things before you know what to do? You, you, can't, you can't be doing this. No, no, don't, don't say that, Jude. We signed a contract. You're supposed to pay me 12 hours after completion. Yes, and it's two weeks. This is not nice. The reason why I'm tolerating this is because you're my friend. And I'm tired of it. Okay. No problem, it's fine. I'll wait. No, don't, don't, try, don't try to do that with me. I'm not in the mood. I'm not. Just stop it. I beg. Bye-bye. Why is he spying on me? That's cute. Is she dead? Why did you leave earlier? Is the caller so important that you have to leave your husband to talk to him on the phone? Babe, calm down. I only wanted to talk to Jude because he owes me money and I knew I was going to be a distraction to your movie. That's why I excused myself. So he's a client that owes you money? Exactly. And you didn't want to distract me from the movie? Yes. Yet you were so nice to him on the phone, you even called him your guy. Babe, that's how I've always talked to him. Jude is a friend that is abusing our friendship. Besides, did you expect me to jump in with aggression? Are you forgetting Jude? The same guy that gifted us the expensive dinner set on our wedding. I don't know him. Maybe you have no reason to get worked up. Oh, I'm getting worked up? Yes. You left your husband to go receive a phone call outside and you tell me I'm getting worked up? Is that the reason why you were spying on me? I wasn't spying on you. I was wondering why my wife had to go outside the estate gate to take a phone call. Estate gate? Stop exaggerating. I was outside the house. Just here. Babe, come on, you know Dominic? Why was he even spying at me? What did you think I was doing? Dominic. Babe, wait. This is Gina Okore. She's unavailable. This is a husband. Who is this? What do you want with my wife, Jude? You've sent the money. Are you kidding me? So did you ask him? What? How am I supposed to ask him? Baby, did you take my calls? Of course not. Yes, you should ask him that. Look, I don't know how he'll respond. The last time we had an argument about Jude, he freaked out. I, I'm just not in the mood for that. But why? How am I supposed to know that? He just freaked out, yelled at me and walked off. You know, up till now, he hasn't told me that Jude called. 
I had to call Jude back and he told me that my husband picked up my call and was very rude to him. Can you imagine that? This is serious. But what was Don's problem? Who the hell knows? You know what? Maybe you're right. I think I should ask him, right? Oh, he could be that, you know. You know what? Gina, men are highly suspicious of their women because they know their way ain't pure. And what's that supposed to mean? It means what it means, Gina. Find out why your husband is so worked up about a stupid phone call. <laughs> Wait. Are you trying to say my husband is cheating on me? I didn't say that. You insinuated it. Gina, all I am saying is he's insecure for a reason. Why? You better not. Okay. You're not doing anything wrong. You're just checking his phone for your peace of mind. Yes. It's my husband's phone. So There's nothing wrong in checking my husband's phone. Um, do I still remember the code? Of course I do. Yes, let's go. Okay. Let's go to your WhatsApp and see what you have been up to. Uh. Okay, who is Linda? Who is Linda? Oh, Linda is from work. Who's next? Let's see. Who else he's always chatting with? Sandy. Damn, who the hell is Sandy? We'll find out. Oh, okay, this is the Sandy, your secretary. You're very lucky. Omotola. <laughs> Which motor are we talking about? I hope. Better not be the Hollywood actress. Okay, this looks like business. Why can't I say anything on his WhatsApp? Okay, let me let me check your Instagram. Instagram DMs. Who has been sending my husband DMs? Whose DM is he replying to? Okay. Can't see anything much. Where do I check? Instagram, Facebook, WhatsApp, Snapchat. Snapchat, that's, that's where I can find all the girls that have been sending you streaks. <laughs> Who has been sending my husband streaks? Okay. You're not active on Snap? That's weird. This guy, this guy is smart. You've deleted all your messages, right? You think you have sense? But I'll catch you one day. Tell me what you need and I will 
Terry, how are you doing? I'm good, thank you. Where's my guy? Oh, let me get him for you. You can have a seat if you want. Mm. Baby! Babe? Yo. How far now? What's going on? I'm good. Ah, how far, man? Ah. Oh, man. Well, how's everything now? Man, I'm doing okay. Sharp, sharp, sharp. Talk to me, bro. Look, I have an idea. Okay. I know you might not fancy it, but I promise you it's top notch. Okay. I spoke to Isabella yesterday. Can we tell you, do you now? Do not mention that name in this house. Please. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything is fine. All right then. I have to go for my meeting with a client. Which client? Jude. What will you guys be discussing? Strictly business, baby. I'll see you later. Love you. Terry? Hey. Take care of yeah. <laughs> Guy, okay, are you okay? Of course. I'm fine. Look, um, back to what we're discussing. I know you used to date Isabella, okay? But her company is proposing us a very amazing deal. Listen, if you think I'm going to do business with that dubious she-devil, then something is wrong with you. Uh -uh. Guy, cancel that girl from your list. She's a liar, a cheat, and a manipulator. Wait, did she break your heart? I'm not saying no because she broke my heart. I'm saying no because I don't want to have anything to do with that girl, okay? Are, are you aware that she slept with my uncle? Oh, okay. That girl is evil. I hope you don't have anything to do with her. No, no, God, no. Look, find someone else. Let's look for another company. I'm sure there must be someone out there who's willing to help us break through into Celiac. Not that girl. Please. It's going to be tough. You said you can't come here and talk about Isabella, Isabella. Are you serious? When my wife is around. Oh, sorry, sorry. Huh? Sorry. <sighs> exactly how you said it. But you know what? Let's talk about it later. I'm currently driving and I don't want to be distracted. Yes, I'll call you in about 10 minutes. There about. I'll call you back, okay? I need him. He won't pick his calls. Huh? 
Hello, Michael. How are you? Yes, my car just broke down on the road. No, no, no. You have to leave whatever you're doing and come get me. Um, I'm on the street before my street. Yes, please. I'm waiting for you. Hurry. Neighbor. All right. It's oh, you. It's me. Neighbor. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. What's wrong with your car? I don't know. We just stopped moving. Let me have a look. Is there a problem? But it seems perfectly okay. Have you called your mechanic? Yes, I have. He said he'll be here soon. Okay. Um, so are you going to wait for him to come or you have somewhere else to not be? Not at all. I'm not waiting. I'll just go home and he'll come get the key from me at home. Okay then. Can I drop you off? Well, that's so kind of you. Thank you. All right. So this. Uh... Let me just grab the key on my bag. Oh, okay. That's it, yeah. Let's go. Talk to you later. Bye. Thank you once again. God bless you. Hey, baby. Who the hell is that? Oh, that's our neighbor. And why is he driving you? Since when did he become your driver? Babe, you wouldn't imagine what happened to me today. My car broke down on the road and dumped me. He offered to bring me home. Why didn't you call me? Check your phone, Dominic. I called. Uh huh. Just one missed call. Well, I thought you were at work or in a meeting. I'm sorry, next time I'll make sure to give you 100 missed calls. We're not done talking. I am done. Wait, wait, wait. wait, hold on. What's with the attitude? I saw you with a man I don't know. Of course, it's only right for me to ask who he is. What's going on? Why, why are you so worked up I about this? I am not worked up. You seem like the one worked up with my business. Your business? Babe, your business is my business. So it's okay for you to answer my calls and not tell me about it? What are you talking about? You answered my call from Jude. Because you weren't in the room. I was helping you. So why didn't you tell me about it? I forgot. You forgot? Dominic, do you have a problem trusting me? What does that mean? You're always sniffing around me to see if something fishy is going on. Is there something fishy going on? Hey, you're my woman and I care about you. That's my only way of showing concern. I'm not doing this. Why is she worried about me sniffing? She's my wife, it's my job to sniff. Really? Yeah. But don't you do that with your girl? Sniff her out? Point of correction. I don't have a girlfriend. I broke up with Tracy because she's a sniffer. 
Yeah, that's why you and I are different. See, I've been through enough drama with women to be you. Okay, I want to know more. I want to dig further. So, what now? What are you going to do? Find out who I'm married. To go, tell them to go, tell them to go, tell them to go. What did you do? It's a very simple trick, to be honest. You change her friend's name to yours. That way, if there's any funny business to report, you'll be the first to know. It's genius. And um, what if she finds out? How will she find out? Oh, it's never there. So you just lie? That's perfect for your marriage. I mean, stop this for me to really do it. I don't know all this pretense. Who do you pretend to give? Hey, one minute. Remember the girl I told you about? Yeah. She's outside. Let me let me get her. Okay. So Dominic, this is a jury. She has worked with a couple of people at Celiac Enterprises mm. and she's more than willing to join our team. Okay. Nice to meet you. Same here, thank you. Um, Jerry has said so much about you. He said you're seeking to call a deal with them at the incoming project. Yep. Do you have any way in for us? Um, I may have one or two. My contact at the company is still very solid. And since we're going to be working together, I can help you get in touch with them on your behalf. Nice. Fine, right? Yeah. Um, okay, um, I'm going to call you so we can finalize whatever we have going on, okay? Okay. We'll be in touch. Okay, mm. thank you very much. Sir. You're welcome. Yeah, of course. I'll call you. <laughs> Guy. Guy. <laughs> what? Are you sure 
You didn't bring this girl to my office because she's good looking. <laughs> Dominic, a jury is good at what she does. Hmm. Yes. She's good at what she does. Or you want to get laid? Which one is it? <laughs> Uh, now this thing we really do where I know like. Come on, look. Um, in the course of working together, if we become friends, good. In the course of working together, if she likes me, that's good too. And in the course of working together, if you sleep with her, that's good too, right? <laughs> come on, bro. You know, I, you know, I need to come up with a new rule in this office. Okay. No sleeping with your co-worker. <laughs> bro. Yeah. Chill. No, you chill. <laughs> Tell your thing down there to chill, bro. <laughs> Come on, bro. Oh, oh, man. Guy. Are you sure of what you are saying? Yes. It was not me. Dominic changed your name to his name on my phone. Like, I don't understand my husband these days. Why would he do something <sighs> like that? Maybe he wants to catch you right in the act. You know I'm the first person you usually call. Exactly. That's some smart move. No. I call you every day. Didn't he think I'll find out soon? That's a dumb move. Why is he so suspicious of my every move? <laughs> Babe, maybe because he is madly in love with you. What sort of stupid love is that? Please. You have a fiancé, don't you? Does he police you around like this? No. My child is a very normal person. Thank you very much. This was the same thing my dad did to my mom. He policed her every single time. And whenever he saw a man around her, he would ask her 20 million questions. Meanwhile, he was the one cheating. He was sleeping around with everything in skirt. Every single lady in the neighborhood, he had a taste. Honestly, I, I can't deal, man. Do you know, you don't think Don's like your father, do you? Because that's some hardcore Casanova shit right there. I don't know what to think. But Lana, I... I need your help with something. What? I have an idea. <laughs> My husband is back. Hey, baby! Hey. Baby, you're good. How was work? It was good. Mm, I miss you. I missed you too. <laughs> Hello, Lana. Good evening, our husband. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What's up now? What are we doing? I want you to help me contact Faith. Faith? Yes. What do you need that slot for? Just help me contact her, please. <sighs> yeah, come in. Oh, hi. Hi. What can I do for you? I'm here to see G. My girl. You mean Jenna? And who are you? Are you her man? Well, Jenna is not at home at the moment, so maybe you should come back later. Oh, I'll just wait. I didn't say you could sit. Oh, well. I'll wait for her. Let me ask you a question. Are you deaf? Huh? I said my wife is not at home. Why do you want me out so badly? Why? Can you leave my house? Hold on. Are you nervous? Do you want me? Who is nervous? Relax. Uh, 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 you should relax, okay? Uh, oh, are, are, you, are you okay? Is everything okay at home? Relax. Uh-uh. You will enjoy it. You are telling, I'm telling you to get out. You are telling me to relax. Can you leave my house? Look at someone I'm even trying to help. Why so stiff? Oh, please. You are trying to help? Oh, please, please, please. Ah. <laughs> no. 
feet. How far now? How did it go? Oh, no show. No show, nothing. What? Ha. Wait, so you mean you didn't wink at you or even squeeze his number? I beg, stop. Uh -uh. I say he rejected me. Eh? You deaf. You know the answer when he shouts for me. Which is actually very weird because no man has ever turned me down. Of course, that's why I'm surprised. I beg, I beg, I beg. I'm out of here. Eh? Ah, wait. I beg, I beg, I beg. Am I dreaming? Who the hell are you? And what are you doing on my husband's desk? I am a jury and I work here. Since when? Anyways, where's my husband? Um... Wait a minute. What is that expression on your face? Oh my God. Dominic, this is the height of it. Get out from... You're under the giving her... Are you sure you're okay? Why are you looking for him under the table? Shh. Where's my husband? Where is my husband? Um, Mr. Dominic stepped out to get lunch. To get lunch? For who? I believe for himself. Okay, smarty pants. Your time is up. I want to sit on my husband's chair. Is this a joke? Get out. Are you done work? Welcome, sir. Hi. Welcome back. Hi, baby. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, Ajiri, can you excuse us for a moment, please? Okay, sir. Who the hell is she? She's here to help me score a deal with the Celia group. Hmm. And how come I'm just seeing or hearing about her for the first time? Because you don't work in this office. Aji is newly employed. Aji? You have a pet name for her already? Oh my God. Why is a newly employed sitting on my husband's chair? You even have the F entry to buy her lunch. Because she's helping me work on a proposal that I'm submitting soon. Uh, did you really expect me to buy lunch for just me? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm not that kind of guy, all right? Besides, why are you here? Well, I miss my husband, so I came to see you. You know I can see through you, right? What's that supposed to mean? It means you're lying. Why did you come to my office without calling me? Well, I didn't know I needed to take permission before coming to my husband's office. Well, as you can see, I'm really, really busy, so... Okay, I'll leave. But, since you bought two packs of food, I'm taking this with you. Of course. You can collect the other one from your secretary. She's not my secretary, all right? She's what? a consultant. Whatever. Bye, baby.
actually have a point. Yes, yes, yes. I, I will do as you've said. Okay, baby girl, I'll talk to you later, okay? Yeah. Hi. I love you too. Hi, baby. Babe. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just tired. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, we got the contract. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Congratulations, baby. I'm so happy for you. Thank you, brother. You always make me proud. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm planning something special for you. You are? You'll see. Yeah. Thank you, my love. I'm really happy. I know. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, babe. Mm. I have to go to bed. I'm so tired. All right, baby, it's fine. Mm. I will join you soon. Yeah. All right. Okay. <clears throat> uh. 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 Baby, are you okay? Mm -hmm. oh. Are you sure you're good? Yes. Or you need some TLC? Oh, Ajiri is such a special girl. What? Ajiri is what? What uh, did you say? Um, she, she was instrumental to us getting the contract to design Celiac's new branches. I thought I heard you sing. Uh, I'm so tired, I'm exhausted. Okay, I need to sleep. Okay. I heard you say. Did you say a jury is special? Dominic? Dominic. Dom. Okay, it's fine. Fall asleep. I know what you're doing, and one day I will catch you. A jury is special, my foot. <laughs> Lana was right. Hey, love. I'm in love with you, that's true. Today I will, I will catch you. <laughs> it's crazy, bro. Oh man. Well, yeah. Um, you know, let me just quickly go through the designs again. I'll let you know. Oh, okay. So, yeah. when you go through the design, just give me a call. Of course. Okay. Talk to you later. Yeah.
Welcome back, baby. <laughs> what is this? Babe, <laughs> what's going on? Remember when I told you I was going to do something cute for you? There we go. <laughs> Aww, this is so beautiful. Yes. And I want to say thank you because you gave me the first hint uh, about celiac expansion. I know I'm super like that. Yes, super beautiful and super intelligent. You can say that again. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, baby, and congratulations once again. We did it. We did it. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, you know what? Let me quickly go get the dessert. AG, I promise you, you're going to love hey, this ice cream. Hey! Why did you just call me? <sighs> Shit. Babe, I'm... I'm Dominic. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. Okay, I've been working with Ajiri all day and... <sighs> sorry, sorry, sorry. We, we even went to, to get the ice cream together. Wow. You went to get the ice cream with AG. Yeah, we, we stopped by at the supermarket to get the ice cream together. But Terry, Terry was there. He was the one that insisted for her to join us. Of course. Of course. Baby, I'm, I'm sorry. What I meant to say... Look, what you I'm, meant to say was Gina, right? No, I meant to say baby. Okay, I'm sorry, babe. Um, please, can I... Can I go get the ice cream, please? Yeah, sure. Go get the ice cream you and Ejiri bought together. Just give me a second. I'll, I'll, I'll be back. <sighs> Lana, no, 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 don't tell me that. I can swear that this man is cheating on me. Imagine he called me a jury in my own house. What sort of nonsense is that? Look, I am 100% sure he's cheating. That's why he organized this stupid dinner, because he's guilty. Come on, babe, you need to calm down. Stop it. Don't tell me to calm down. Now tell me, how would you feel if Charles calls you another woman's name? But it could actually be a slip of tongue. What sort of stupid slip of tongue is that? This is the second time he's calling me a jury. He called me that name in his sleep. Um, that's a lot. Now you understand what I'm saying. Who the hell is she talking to? I'm sure it's that Jude guy. Do you know what? I'll call you right back. Dominic, I see you. Hey, hey, I see you. What? You see this thing you're doing? What's that? You're playing with fire and that fire will burn you. Hey, you, you say I'm spying on you. Why won't I spy on you? When you're coming outside to take phone calls. Tell me what you need and I will make 
Hello? What did you say? You saw my husband at what hotel? With who? What, who was he with? What was he doing? Was he inside the hotel? Oh my God. Dominic, you will not kill me. You're gallivanting hotels while I'm here sleeping? 
Hey babes, what's up? Yes, I'm there and I've gone round the place. I can't find him. Yeah, I saw his car at the car park, but he's nowhere to be found. Are you sure they're here? Yes, but why did you leave without waiting for me first? That was the agreement. But I went to pick up my niece from school. I can't leave her there any longer. You know her parents traveled now. It's fine. It's fine, I totally understand. Um, just do what you have to do. But remember that my marriage is in crisis and I need you. Okay? All right, I'll now wait for you. Just not. I guess I should just go because. Right, we'll just guy's maybe sit and we'll wait for the client for some time. Uh, yeah. I think we should sit here. Go ahead. Sorry, could, could you just give me a second? You can order. Yeah. Huh? Hey! Baby! <laughs> I, I, baby, I, it's, it's so good to see you. What are you doing here? Well, I should be asking you that question. What are you doing here? Oh, I... <clears throat> I came to... Um, I'm, I'm waiting for my friend. Actually. You're waiting for your friend? Yes, and what are you doing here with the lady? Oh, we have a team meeting. Ajib is part of my team, and uh, Terry will be joining us. Apparently, the client we're meeting is being delayed somewhere, but he will join us soon. I see. So, this friend of yours, a man? No, a woman, Lana. She went to pick up her niece from school. I'm just here waiting for her. So, Lana and her niece will be joining you here in a hotel? A hotel that is also a restaurant. Yes. <laughs> and this lady, Ejiri, why did you say she's here again? She's part of my team. We're seeing the client together. With Terry. Terry. Yes. Awesome. Oh, you're welcome to join us if you want, no, or you can wait for us. There have no need for that. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you later. All right. Have fun at your meeting, work meeting, right? Take care of yourself. Mm, you too. Hi, so have you ordered? No, that's what I was just ordered. Oh, right, right. <laughs> uh, Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, just, uh, of course. I thought he said it was just business meeting. Why are they ordering food? Absolutely. Um, yeah, you can tell that she's lying. It was written all over her face. Like, what is a married woman doing in a hotel? Can you answer that? Bro, I think you should have this conversation with your wife. So she can lie to me again? <laughs> okay. Uh, Bro, you need to calm down. I'm calm. I'm actually really calm. I just don't want her to make a fool out of me. I told myself that no woman, no woman was going to treat me like that ever again, especially not my wife. And how far are you sure that she wasn't there with her friend? <laughs> oh, she wasn't there to see her friend. She was certainly not there to see her friend because I hired someone to follow up. You hired someone to follow your wife? Yes. I paid the waiter to monitor her. And guess what he told me? He told me that she left Immediately we left. I must get to the bottom of this, actually. Wait, wait. So, so you're texting the waiter? I'm texting Polo, the man who helped me catch Isabella and the hundred men she was sleeping with. No, bro. As far as I'm concerned, your wife is a decent woman. That is your opinion. And Paul is about to help me confirm if your opinion is fact. Wait. So you paid a private investigator to follow your wife? Hmm. They didn't know this guy. Come on, Dominic. God.
Baby, where are you now? I'm so hungry and I'm about to eat without you. Babe, I'll advise you go ahead. We'll be working very late and I don't know what time I'll come home. <sighs> yeah. Um, sir, can I get you suya and ginger beer since you'll be working very late? Okay, that's fine. All right. Uh, babe, babe, who's... Are you working late with Ejiri? Yes. And I just heard something about beer. Are you guys drinking beer? Babe, it's ginger beer. It's non-alcoholic. And we'll be working very late, which is why she wants to get us something to eat. Look, just let me focus on work so I can come back on time, okay? I love you. Baby, I don't like... What kind of madness is this? He's going to cut and call on me. I'm supposed to eat without you. No, you. Should I go to his office? Ooh. Hey, darling. Do you want to go home, or you want to have some quality time? Here? Forget about her. Stay here with me. I just miss you so much. I miss you too. Glad you're back home. Yeah. You didn't eat your food? No, I couldn't eat without you. Um, okay, let me freshen up. Okay, I'll microwave it for you. It will never come to pass in Jesus' name. I reject it. Dominic, see what you're doing to me. You're getting me worked up. Who comes home at 11 p.m.? I reject it. I sniffed him. He wasn't smelling like a woman. I searched his bags and there was nothing incriminating in it. Do you think it's all in my head? Am I getting worked up over nothing? Well, Gina, maybe he's different. I mean, you already tested him with faith. If that doesn't work, I wonder what to do. You're right. But, Lana, there is, there is something that I'm not understanding. I just feel like... I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> what? What is that? What? That thing you just did to my ears. I learned somewhere that women like it. You've never done it to me before. Where did you pick that up from? Hey, who taught you? Babe, 
What are all these questions for? I have every right to know who's been teaching my husband tricks in bed. Okay, now you've ruined the mood. And where are you going to? Anywhere but here. Dominic. Dominic, you better come back and tell me who... Th Dominic. What? I'm stretching now. Since when did us stretching become a type of Please exercise? Please stop it. I don't like it. You stop it. Somebody cannot stretch in peace again. Stop it. I, I, you were disturbing me. I just wanted to. It's just a jury. There's nothing to it. Hello? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you, dear. Thank you for reminding me. Okay. I'm coming out now. Won't you at least eat first before going to see your dear? I want to pick up a file from her. Oh, I'll be back. Your dear. Thank you so much. Yeah, good morning, morning sir. Hi, morning. How are you? <laughs> it's okay, yeah. Whew. Um, okay. Sir, you've got nothing to worry about. We've got Celia Corelli, and trust me, we're going to back this one, too. Yeah, we have to fight hard to make this work. I mean, if this contract goes to Abu and his guys, I'll be really pissed. Um, Terry and I have a meeting this morning. Um, we'll just come up with a schedule, and I'll get back to you on it. So okay. worry not, okay? <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. That's okay. Ah. What was that? You what? didn't hear it. Uh, maybe it was a bird or something. No, it's not a bird. It's your wife. I saw her. My wife? Yes. What is she doing there? <sighs> um, please, excuse me. Let me find out what's going on. Also, please, find out what Abu is offering so we can counter it, okay? Okay, sir. Thank you. All right, sir.
Baby. Baby. Where is she? G. Okay. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to startle you. What happened? I, I, I injured myself. I think I have a dislocation here. Injured yourself doing what? Is that a question you're supposed to be asking me? What happened to baby? I'm sorry. How can I help you? Okay. Sorry. How can I help you? Don't worry about it. I'm done. <laughs> what were you doing when you injured yourself? I, 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 the food was ready, so I was looking for you to tell you that, that the food was getting cold. You mean the food you barely left on the table? Well, I was just thinking ahead. I mean, you went out there with that lady and you were discussing God knows what. We were discussing business. That's the only thing we talk about. Well, your business was taking ages. You should be grateful that I care enough about you. Looking for you. Uh. Ajiri said she observed you looking at us from the fence. What? Nothing. Why would she say a thing like that? Is she high on cheap drugs? Is she hallucinating? Never mind. Do you know what? Where is she? Where is she? Wait now. What do you mean, where is she? Where is she? How do you want to walk there? Oh, Are you okay? Does it hurt? Of course it hurts. <clears throat> Can I carry you? That would be nice. <laughs> Tell me what you need and I will make it still. Darling. 
I don't understand. Yeah, it is like that, Dominic. Your wife's daily routine. It's first is a client, then secondly, she follows you, especially when you go out with Ajiri. When I go out with Ajiri? Yeah. What does that even mean? You know, I followed her, she followed me. She resumed at your office by 12 every day, at least by 4. By Thursday, she leaves by 3 to hang out with the friends. Yeah. Sometimes she checked on you in the office in the morning, sometimes she does not. Wait, uh, are you saying that... In my opinion, I think your wife is tracking you, maybe your phone. What? Do you want me to continue? Um, yes, uh, well, uh, when I want you to stop, I'll let you know. Okay, boss, there's no problem. Yeah. Thank you so much. I'll, I'll send you the payment for this one. Okay, boss. Thank you. Okay, I will spit my last one. No problem. Thank you. What? You still haven't answered my question, you know? Dominic, what do you think I do all day? And why are you so interested in my daily routine? Why are you so sneaky about it? Well, if you must know, I work, I cook, and I take care of the house. That's all I do. <laughs> wow. So it took you 20 minutes to come up with that lie? And how is it a lie? Because someone told me that they see you sitting every day in your car, in front of my office, watching me. Come to your office to do what exactly? Am I your bodyguard? Or do I look that jobless to you? I don't know. Why do you do it? I never. Let me remind you. I have a life. I'm a business coach and I have people calling me all over the world. Okay, Madam Business Coach, in case you're doing something like that, I need you to stop. It's very disturbing. Okay, sir. I'll take it under advisement should I decide to become Mrs. Creepy. Liar, liar, liar. She's such a bloody liar. I can't believe she would look me in the face and lie to me like that. I have her on video. Wait, did you at least show these videos to her? Of, co of course not. Absolutely not. Because I don't think she'd be so thrilled about the PI part. Oh. I can't... Uh, I can't believe that she would lie to me like that. <laughs> Women. They're so artistic when it comes to deception. I don't think they will make heaven though. <laughs> Honestly, I, I don't think there's space for them in heaven. Hi guys. Hi. Ajibi, you look amazing. Oh. You look gorgeous today. Wow, really? Well, thank you guys. Um, I'm just about to go get lunch. Did you guys need me to get anything for you? Yes, please. I'm starving. Jollof and turkey works for me. Okay. What about you? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to have the same. Okay. Cool. I'll send the money to your bank account. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you. You're such an angel. Come on, it's it, it's fine. I'll see you guys soon, okay? Bye. Um, I have a question. You just called her an angel. Does it mean she is not in the group of women that are going to go to hell? Yeah, I'm talking about Jenna and the rest of them, and you're are you bringing up a Jerry. Oh. So, you're talking about all the women you've been with and the woman you married. All of them are evil. They're going to go to hell as opposed to you, who is a saint. Saint Dominic, right? Are you trying to blame me? Bro, 
You've put a private investigator to follow your wife. Because I saw some red flags. Why would she make a habit out of following me? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe because you are this crazy and schizophrenic person. Bro, I won't be surprised if your suspiciousness made her suspicious of you. Mm. And now she's running with it everywhere. Look, you can blame me all you want, but I smell something fishy. And I'm going to get to the bottom of it. Look, I think you have to have a conversation with your wife. So she can end up lying to me again. Then just, just tell her about your, your trust issues, okay? Wait. Why did you even get married to this woman? I thought you got married to her because we were ready to get vulnerable around her. Well, I don't think I can do that with her at this point, especially with the way things are going. Dominic, look, at this point, I think you can't just sweep everything under the carpet because this is going to go down to the very foundations of your relationship and, and implode. And I don't think I want that for you. You don't want that for yourself either. You need to fix this. Fine. I'll try and have a conversation with her. No. Dominic, this time, don't just try. You need to have a conversation with her this time. is Rosalind. Hey, babe. Okay. Hey, baby. I, 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 I was just trying to check the time on your phone. Well, Rosalind is a new client. Her contact is new on my phone because I just met her like Yesterday, she wants me to create a new design for her shopping mall. Would you like us to give her a call? Um, no, no, there will be no need for that. I'll just go to bed. Good night. Gina. Hmm? I don't think we're doing great as a couple. What's that supposed to mean? Do you trust me? Yes, I trust you. You're my husband. Uh, I, I didn't even hear a word of what you just said. I said you're my husband. It would be insane for me not to trust you. Why would you even ask me that kind of question? Because I know you were watching me. What? The day that Ajiri came to see me, you were watching me. That loud sound I heard was you falling. Please don't, don't deny it, okay? Even Ajiri said she confirmed that she saw you. There we go again. Every time Ajiri, Ajiri, Ajiri. Was it the same Ajiri that told you I was stalking you at your office? No, Ajiri has nothing to do with this. Why are you even bringing her name into this conversation? You brought her up just now. That's because I'm trying to prove a point. I'm trying to establish that we have trust issues in this relationship. No, you have trust issues. I do not have any trust issues. I trust you just fine. Look me in the eye and tell me that you trust me. I trust you. You can't even look at me in the eye. No, you look me in the eye and tell me you trust me. That's the thing. I, I don't. You don't? No, I don't. Why? I, 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 I don't know. Look, I honestly don't know, but I, I don't want us to remain like this. Spying on me, sneaking around, was certainly better than that. Look, I want us to work, G. Me too. But we won't work if we keep doing this. It's not just me, okay? 
You're very extra with your mistrust. You take my calls without telling me. When you see me talking to a guy, you freak out. It made me suspicious of you. Okay. I mean, why is everything so fishy around you if you're not selling the fish yourself? I understand your point, and I will work on it. Me too. Are you sure? Yes. I will stop going through your phone. Look, I don't have a problem with you going through my phone. I, I, I have nothing to hide. Let's, let's just not be sneaky about it. Okay. From now on, I will stop sneaking around. And spying? What? I don't spy on you. Okay, I... I will stop that soon. I'm sorry. Baby, don't tell me you want to live without my kiss. <laughs> I'll see you later. All right, I wish you a great day at work. And you too. Okay. Dominic, what are you up to? Yeah, boss, she has parked right in front of your office. How long has she been? Like 20 minutes now. Why is this woman so stubborn? I think she's staying shorter than now. I want you to stay on her. Yesterday she stayed for about uh, 30 minutes. Well, stay on her for a couple of days. If nothing happens, then we're done. Honestly, I don't even know what to think about the situation. But I know that I'm... Babe. What is it? I know this man. I think he's been following me around. I think he's talking to me. I, I saw him at the supermarket yesterday. He was following me and now he's here. Could it be a coincidence? You noticed him following yesterday? Yes, yes, I... Yes, I can recognize him anywhere. I saw him in his car close to my house. He what? was following me. Oh my God. I, what should I do? Should I, should I call the police? Did you tell your husband? No, not yet. I thought it was a bloody coincidence, so I didn't want to disturb him, but... Seeing him here now is scaring me. I am so... What are you about to do? This man could be dangerous. <laughs> My fiancé is in the freaking army. He should bring it on. Hey! 
Why are you stalking my friend? What is the deal? Did you sell something to her and she has not paid? Yes. What is it? What the hell is your problem? Why do you keep following me around? Look, I have your plate number written down and I will report you to the police. Exactly. Whatever it is you're planning, it's going to backfire on you, stalker. Lady, I'm here just to call off my... Oh, head. shut up, you bloody liar. What are you saying? I don't know you guys. If I see you around me one more time, I will bathe you with acid. And look, she is not joking. Stay the hell away. Yes. Let's get Let's out of here. Away. Babe, you won't believe what happened to me at the restaurant today. Dominic? Dominic, you must be so tired. from Paul. Hello, Mr. Dominic. Your wife just met me. She almost fought with me. I'll have to call it quits. If you want this to continue, get another PI. Get another PI? What is that supposed to mean? Wait. PI as in private investigator? guy from the restaurant was from you? Dominic. Dominic, wake the hell up! You are the very worst. How could you? Will you wake the hell up? What? You hired a private investigator to follow me around town? Why would you do that? Oh, now you want to play dumb like you don't know what I'm talking about. Read your damn messages, Dominic! Why on earth would you hire a private investigator to follow your wife? Is that how insecure you are about our relationship? Why would you do this? Oh, well, that's rich coming from you. You're the one sneaking in and out of my private messages, stalking me at the office. I, I have videos. Don't deny it. I needed to know what was going on between you and Ejiri. You seem to lighten up whenever you see her. That's because she's a sane person. She's not a maniac like you. Wow. You have a thing for another woman and yet I'm the crazy one. This thing you're trying to do, I know it. But I will not allow you gaslight me. What are you even talking about? What am I talking I'm about? I'm not cheating on you. I would never do that to you. Isabella did it to me and it broke me. I'm not that kind of guy. Why don't you trust no, me? No, you trust me. Why can't you trust me? Who the hell hires a private investigator on their wife? Look, my PI told me that you're tracking my phone. You're literally following me everywhere. But yours is worse. To think that I was thinking that I had a stalker. Meanwhile, it was my husband that paid somebody to follow me around. Why would you do that? I thought it was a stalker that tried to kill me. Congratulations, you got me freaked out. Gina. Nick, you always preach about honesty and trust. But what do you do? The same thing you preach against? If you have demons, suck them out. If you have issues, work on them. But no, you decided to slam me with your distrust. And now, like a normal wife would do, I became curious and yet you stand here and you try to blame me? Look, you need to stop blaming this on me. You're as guilty as I am. No, you started it. I did what any curious wife would do. But you acted like a freaking psycho. You paid a guy to follow me, your wife, to take pictures of me. How could you? I'm disappointed in you. I know. 
before, I was done darling Why you came and sweep me like a wind You made me love up and I was crying Where's the feeling? If you say that you love me If you say that you need me Don't you dare put your hands on me I'm sorry you're sorry you got caught, Dominic. No, I'm sorry I caused you pain. Did you think of that before doing what you did? <clears throat> Why are you acting like I'm the only guilty party here? Sure. I hired a guy to follow you around and make you feel like your life was threatened. <sighs> Please, stop being dramatic. Do not! Don't try to trivialize my trauma. Trauma. Yes, honey. You traumatized me. When I saw that guy at the restaurant, I was terrified. Thank God my girls were there with me. You traumatized me, Dominic, and I want you to have that at the back of your mind when you lay next to me. I'm sorry. I'm sincerely sorry. Jill. G. I don't know what is wrong with her. It's not like she didn't track my phone. I warned you about this. Guy, please. I don't need this right now. I told you so it's the last thing I want to hear from you, please. But I did. And you ignored me. The same way I'm about to give you a, a brilliant idea right now, which you most definitely ignore me again. What is it? I think you need professional help. Take counseling. Like a marriage therapy. Mm hmm Guy, please. It's not that serious. We haven't gotten to that point. We just had a little fight. <laughs> little fight? Trust issues is not a little fight. Little differences. Bro, do you want her to start filling in irreconcilable differences before you take it seriously? What did he do you now? Why would you say that to me? Bro, you have trust issues. Deal with it. It's not like this is just going to disappear into thin air if you don't think about it. You are always going to wonder what she's doing with that guy. You always want to get to the bottom of this. And that, my friend, is not healthy. Well, thank you very much for your advice, but my wife is just upset. She will get over it. I've said my bit. Hey babe, I'm going to work. Babe, Dinner. It looks lovely. Okay, G, enough with the silent treatment. It's childish. I made dinner. I'm eating the dinner. But you know what? I'm actually done with the dinner. Darling, why you came and 
with me like always. You made me love up, and I was crying. Where's the feeling? If you say that you love me, if you say that you need me. This love got me screaming. If you say that you love me, if you say that you need me, I'll come back crawling. Cause this love got me screaming. Oh. Jenna, I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry. I promise I'm going to work on it. I'm going to work on me, on us. Isabella did a number on me. She slept with almost everyone that I know, including my uncle. That's why I left his firm. I didn't know Terry too well then, else I'm sure she would have slept with him too. Look, I know I went too far with the PI guy, and I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry that you, f you felt threatened. I'm sorry you felt unsafe. Sorry about my craziness. I'm going to see a therapist. In fact, I think we should both see a therapist together as a couple. Please. It's not just you, you know. I got crazy too. I thought two can play that game. And that wasn't a very smart move. Yeah. I'm sorry. Truly. I'm sorry too. I promise to work on myself to be a better wife for you.
I miss my baby girl. <laughs> I miss you too. <laughs> Baby? Babe? Yeah. Your office wife is calling you. Get it before it cuts. Yeah, okay. Hello, Jerry. How are you? Mm hmm. Okay, just make it happen as discussed. Yeah, sure, you can come drop off the files at home. My wife is around. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Yeah. My office wife, huh? Is that not what she is? Oh. <laughs> that's what she is, huh? That's what she is. So you're no longer jealous. Baby, stop. This you, is C finish. You know I don't like it when you C tickle finish. me. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> so it's you actually... want me to be jealous? <laughs> stop it, Dominic. <laughs> You ready? Of course I am. All right, come on. <clears throat> oh my God. <clears throat> let's go, let's go. All right, it's been a long time we had a show together. Of course. So. Mm -hmm. Easy. This is nice. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ladies first. <sighs> Can't remember the last time we took strollings like this. <laughs> well, we're doing it now. <laughs> yes, baby. Hi. Hmm? Your neighborhood boyfriend is saying hello. <laughs> hey, man. Hey. Good uh, to see you. How are you doing? I'm good, I'm good. All I'm done. Good. <laughs> yeah, I'm good to see you. Babe, say hi. 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 Uh, How are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. I mean, you're looking so gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's what I said. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but good to see you. Yeah, good to see, see you. Too. Yeah, all right. All right, sure. Okay. <laughs> Babe, what just happened? What? What do you mean? Babe, where did all that? Where is my husband? Where did all that jealousy go? Okay, can you stop being dramatic? Oh, it's I gone. can't. <laughs> you even called him my neighborhood boyfriend. Is it not your neighborhood boyfriend? Ha! Ah, Jesus be praised. <laughs> <laughs> I love this new husband. <laughs> wow, this is. Strange. Yeah. 